Greetings. Welcome to the late Cretaceous period, 67 million years ago, in what is now known as North America. Ah, we're all waiting for the eggs to hatch. Hi! I'm True Dawn. True Dawn. It means tooth that wounds. That's because of the very sharp teeth that I have. We're also the smartest dinosaurs around. Hey, Mr. Trudon, my friend and I have a problem. We had five seeds, I ate two, and now there's only one left. How many did my friend eat? Your friend ate two. I knew it. Hey, Percy, I told you, you owe me two seeds. <laughs> See? Super smart. I'm pretty much half the size of a human being. But since I'm a theropod like a T-Rex, I'm at the top of the food chain. Mr. Trudon, my friends and I only have this one cicade, but both want it. What do we do? Awesome. You're the coolest. Sharp teeth and very sharp toe claws. Oh, they're going to hatch. Well, it looks like we're going to have a big birthday party tonight. But tomorrow, they have to start learning math if they're going to be smart like me. One, two, three! Oh, hi. I'm Corythosaurus. That's Cor, Rytho, Saurus. Do you know what that means? Helmet lizard. It's because of this thing on my head. My herd and I use them to make amazing sounds. Listen. <laughs> okay, that's not exactly what it's supposed to sound like. It must be all the dust from the volcanoes over there. <laughs> wow, what a sound. That's awesome. How come I can't make a big sound? Why can't I do it? Did you hear that? It's my herd calling. I'm gonna answer them if it's the last thing I do. <laughs> what am I doing wrong? There's my herd. I wonder if they wanna play with me. Hey guys, what do you say we play a game of, whoa! Did you hear that? Did you? Oh, joy! I wonder if they heard it. Oops. Sorry to wake you. I was just so excited that I finally made the same sound as you guys. I'll be quieter. That's what I call fresh air on the open range. My name is Ineosaurus. That's i ne o -saurus. It means buffalo lizard. Did you know that I'm from what is now known as Montana? Only here, nowhere else in the world. You know, there's more to the late Cretaceous period than trees and stinky flowers. I'm a ceratopsid. That means I'm a herbivore. I eat plants. And I have a beak. And we have these big curved horns on our noses. Looks like a big bottle opener, doesn't it? Too bad there's no such thing as bottles in the late Cretaceous period. And I live in a big herd, which is great if there are any big dinos around that might be a threat. Just one of us might not be enough to scare off a big gobbler dino, even though we're six meters long and weigh two tons. But put us all together, and there is safety in numbers. And hey, if that doesn't work, there's always the old stampede! Am I glad to see you? 
I thought you'd pass right by. I'm Eustreptospondylus. That's pronounced Eustreptospondylus. But you can call me Esther. This is my island, here in the Middle Jurassic period, nearly 160 million years ago. Pretty nice, huh? Eustreptospondylus means well-curved vertebrae, which are those bones in your back. As you can see, we are great dancers. Theropods like us are naturals. A theropod means two-legged dino, by the way. This makes us great at doing things on two legs, like running and dancing. And you can tell how much I love to dance. We're pretty long, about the size of a city bus. And we're four meters high at the hips. That's like how high you can jump up on a trampoline. Like most theropods, we have big teeth to eat with and two small arms, which makes it hard to clap, but perfect for playing the maracas. You know what time it is? That's right, limbo time! The Limbo King. Only one thing to do now. Give the trophy to the best dancer around. And then, what else? Dance! Oh yeah, so good, love it. You should taste these plants and grass. It's so good. Oh, excuse my manners. My name is... So hungry. Oh yeah, my name is Brachiosaurus. Wow, I'm hungry. Yes, I know I don't look a kilogram over 60 tons, but I'm still growing. I'll get to be about 16 meters tall. Anyway, I think there's a force over there I can eat. After all, I'd eat my 200 kilograms of food a day. Aren't you scared of me? All dinosaurs are scared of the Allosaurus. No, no, I'm a Brachiosaurus, a plant-eating dinosaur. I'm a herbivore. Bye. Mm, all this talk of food is making me really hungry. Huh? Huh? The herd! Yay! I thought I lost you guys. Excuse me while I join my herd. Oh, I'm lost again. Hey, look, a delicious forest. Yes, there you go. Well, hello. I'm Mutaburasaurus. Yeah, see you with me. Muta Buddha Saurus. And welcome to the early Cretaceous period. Yes, I'm named after Mutabura. The place where they found my fossil in what is now known as Australia. As you can see, I'm the top of my game when it comes to eating these sakai trees. But how's your honking? Bruce. He can honk louder than any Mutaburasaurus around. Mm, yes, yeah, you see, we have these little honkers up here on our heads that we make our calls from. I challenge you to a honk off. A honk off, eh? Hmm, yeah, you're on. I'm a pretty big dino. I'm nine meters long. And I'm a herbivore. <laughs> Not bad, but try this one. Good, that was a real good one. Uh-oh, we seem to have called the whole herd over. Well, since we're all here, 
why don't we have a honk along? Great idea. See you next time. Hi, I'm Massospondylus. You say it like this. Massospondylus. I'm trying to think of what I can do for the Dino Talent Show. It helps to have hands that let me grab things or I'd never be able to do this. <laughs> my name means massive vertebra. Those are the bones in my neck. Here, take a look. Now that's a lot of neck. I live in what is now called South Africa. I'm about the same size as an elephant, but I weigh a lot less because my bones are hollow and I have air sacs that make me lighter. That's how I can be so light on my feet. I know. I could tap dance in for the talent show. Hmm. Maybe not dancing. Oh, I know. I love to sing. Listen. La 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 la. Well, what do you think of my singing? I guess I need to practice more. I wish there was something else I could do for the Dino Talent Show. Something I was good at. Oh well, I'm sure it'll come to me. See you at the talent show. Ladies, we're never going to eat if you two keep scaring off the insects. Sorry, Sorry that, that was, was my bad. bad. Hiya, I'm Saltipus. That's pronounced saltopus. It means hopping foot. I'm Vera. I'm Betty. We're very early theropods. That's meat eaters that walk on their two back legs. Now, girls, now! Okay, this isn't funny. Uh... Oh. <sighs> Welcome to the early Triassic period. 223 million years ago. We're from what is now called Scotland. But not much is known about us other than... We're dinos! Well, actually, they don't know for sure. So, if nobody knows what we really look like, then you might have purple polka dots and a yellow head. <laughs> or she might have horns and two tails. <laughs> Well, I think we to look a little like other dinos. We are about the same size as a cat, but with lots and lots of really sharp teeth. Oh, I don't know. I kind of like what I look like right now. They're mine. Very, very quiet. I'm on the hunt. <gasps> or am I being hunted? I'm Nick Webasaurus. That's Nick Webasaurus. The first dino ever to have a tongue click in his name. <laughs> Hurry, we must keep going. I'm being followed. I may not be big, but I'll have you know I am the great uncle to the powerful and famous T-Rex. In 50 million years, T-Rex will be crowned king of the dinosaurs, and he'll have me to thank. Dinos like me have been found in what is now known as Africa. Though I'm not as large as a T-Rex, I'm still all carnivore. <laughs> I eat insects and small lizards. My hands help me a lot because though I have only three fingers, one is like a thumb, making grabbing much easier. 
And these claws, razor sharp. They help me climb when there are no branches. My talents are hiding and sneaking around. I am super duper at being quiet and, well, invisible, really. But sometimes... Ah! <laughs> We're also very, very jumpy. Hey! Ah! <laughs> Those guys make me laugh. Hello, hello! I'm Nothronicus. That's Nothrone I Cuss. And welcome to our late Cretaceous TV show. No, your dinosaurs! Joining me today are my best buddies, Custard and Ronnie. Hi! Hi. We're talking about what makes us really different from other dinos. Custard, any thoughts? Um, we're on TV? Uh, good try, but no. Even though we're theropods, we don't eat meat. You see, most theropods are carnivores. Great, now I'm hungry. Oh, oh, I've got one. We have very fine feathers covering our whole bodies. Mm-hmm. What else is different about us from most dinos? We have these long claws for snipping leaves and branches. And our teeth aren't sharp, but they're perfect for mashing up plants. And we drool when we chew with our mouths open. I'm not drooling. Let's not forget that we need to eat a lot because we're really big. As big as this giraffe fella here. All right, all right, thanks for coming on the show. We live in what is now called New Mexico. And that's our show. Join us next time in the late Cretaceous period as we discuss asteroids, real or are they a myth? So, who wants to get something to eat?